David Pollock's description, I think of a, a fully accurate description of the state of college football right now with, with our friend Nick Saban sitting right there on the set. Just watch Nick's face as David made this point. George, obviously you've seen in the past couple seasons now really They've taken hold of college football. They did an unbelievable job. Uh, this is a young football team. This isn't an old football team with a bunch of guys lose. Now, listen, the NFL can take its chunk out of any team. Uh, <laughs> David. <laughs> David, <laughs> what, uh, <laughs> what can you tell us about that exchange? First of all, I didn't even think about who I was sitting next to when no. I said that. It had nothing to do with having Nick next to me. But we're at halftime, and y'all know how this works. We're, we got we got to talk about something. And it dang sure wasn't the game. The game was over. Everybody knew that in the stadium. Everybody knew that at home. So it was like, man, look at what George has done and the dominance. And then. You know, I, I had nothing to do with taking a shot at Nick. I, I, Nick didn't say a word, and he wasn't upset in the slightest bit. So it was not Dave, a shot Dave. at Nick Saban. Pa, DP, yeah. DP, you don't have to explain a damn thing, man. <laughs> like, you, the, you, you were being truthful and honest, and, and we have watched – Nick Saban in Alabama say the same type of thing for the last 10 years. Right now, it's Georgia's game. That's, that's what it boils down to. But he will play that highlight a thousand times next year mm -hmm. in his locker room <laughs> and during preseason. I will remind everyone that Marcus Spears won a national championship playing for Nick Saban yeah. at LSU. So if, if anyone knows, he knows. Very quickly, just a, a quick final thought on this because, you know, Alabama, we act like, well, they're, they're a thing of the past. I mean, they did just have a dominant bowl performance, and they were basically two plays away from having a perfect season this year. They never got their crack at Georgia. David, they're not going away, right? I mean, it, it, as people start talking about a three-peat, which has never happened and everything, it, it is still Nick Saban who will have something to say about that, yes? Yeah, and he just had the greatest recruiting class ever. So Alabama's not going anywhere. They've got t plenty of talent. You saw the way they finished the bowl game. Um, but but this Georgia team's coming back. It's going to be loaded. But like uh, Kirby talked about, fighting complacency. I, I don't think we're done seeing, you know, Nick versus Kirby in big games. And we'll probably see it next year in the SC Championship game with a lot on the line. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.